Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're doing a big, pretty little thing, Christmas seasonal party wear haul. And that's like a really long title, but I've got my work's Christmas party next week. I've got no idea what I'm gonna wear. I wanna look sophisticated and still like covered up, but all sparkly and cute. So I put quite a big order in. I'm gonna go through everything, then I'm gonna try it all on at the end. Hope you enjoy the video. Please make sure to subscribe. Trying to be a little bit festive with the Christmas tree in the background, but I know that ring light's really annoying me, but I've got nowhere else to sit. Look how big this parcel is. Literally like Santa sack. Tried to get a little bit of a mixture in here. I've got some more dressy outfits, a bit more glam outfits, more casual outfits. It's got a bit of everything, so I don't really know what vibe I'm going for. So you've got like blazers, blazer dresses, leather trousers, dresses, a bit of everything. So I'm just gonna go through in a random order. I just remembered one of the dresses I got. Oh my God. House of CB dupe for about a fraction of the price, literally. I'm really excited. First thing I've got is just a black cowl neck top. Nice, plain, simple, classy. Love the strap details, actually. It's really, really sparkly and it does cross over at the back. Not that I can really show you, but it's got two little loops. But I love this thing, it's so pretty. I prefer gold over silver jewellery, but I feel like Christmas, everything's silver. So I've got my little silver necklace on. Thought put some like little silver sparkly heels, a little silver glittery bag. Very cute. And again, it's nice and classy and I'll probably wear this quite often as it's nothing too crazy. I know I'm going in like a random order, but I'm literally just pulling everything out of the bag and showing you as I pull it out. I have loads of cute little tops in the hall. And in the winter, I just go for black leather trousers. But because it's like a party, I kind of want to be a bit more dressy. I've got the, I picked these little faux leather shorts. I know they look really big to be fair. I don't even know what size I got. I got a 12 because I'm a 10 normally, but I think with faux leather, obviously there's no stretch at all. So I got these little shorts. I can't really show you in front of the TV, it blends in. But they're just like nice or wired leg like, shorts. It's not going to stick to me a whole, but that's why I got them in a 12 as well. Because I don't want them to be literally like, suffocating me but i thought this would be really cute if you put some boots on long sleeve top something like that it kind of just breaks it up a little bit something different from wearing leather trousers all the time as well right i'm really excited for this one so this is a black blazer as you can see there's a big cut out at the back look at the back detail look at the back of that how pretty is that it's got like little silver gems pearls i love that back detail i feel like it's so pretty but obviously the pearls just giving us sort of classy elegant vibe and obviously with it being a long sleeve blazer it's nothing like out my comfort zone i feel like i'm just talking like this but it's just a blazer at the end of the day so nothing too crazy again could probably get a lot of wear out of this if you go to like a fancy restaurant someone's birthday party this with the leather trousers cute and really warm as well Next, we've got another very, very, very cute top. These are like my playing it safe options. So like I said, I can just chuck these on, pair of leather trousers, sparkly bag. There's my little outfit. This is just a little black corset. As you can see, all the little sparkly details, super cute. It's got that like gel lining around the inside as well. So you know, it like sticks onto your skin rather than sliding down. I feel like the glitter is just so pretty as well. And I got this in a 12 just because Corsets obviously don't stretch again, same as the leather trousers. And this actually got boning in as well. I feel like it'd be quite supportive. I think this dress is absolutely unreal. I know not everybody might think this. And to be fair, I've never wore anything like this, but I saw a girl on my Instagram wearing a dress like this, but it's from House of CB. She looked unreal. So I just think, well, if I buy the dress, I'm gonna look amazing. I'm gonna be a snatch little size four girl with blonde curly hair, obviously. But it's just, this is kind of giving like mean girls vibes now, what um, Regina George wore to prom. <laughs> but it's just a black satin midi dress. It's got this nice like runch detail. I mean, I know it looks kind of huge, but this is giving very glam vibes. Probably not work Christmas party, probably like evening anniversary meal at the Shard. But I just think it's really cute and I just want to try it on. I just want to see whether I look really cute like that girl that I saw on Instagram. But yeah, it's giving cute vibes. I just want to try it on to be honest and feel like a princess. Let's ignore my hair. I say this all the time, but I feel like I look like I've been dragged through a hedge backwards. But if that dress was a little bit too out there, I've got a nice plain Jane, plain it simple jumpsuit. Do I know how to hold this up? No, of course not. It's just a black straight leg jumpsuit. It's got a straight bandeau top and then it's like got a little sleeve detail. So straight across, one sleeve, plain black straight leg jumpsuits i'll throw it on so you can actually see i hope this is not too long for me i didn't actually think this through i'm five foot four 
um, pretty little thing. Petite is too short, but regular it's normally too long. But we're going to try it on anyway. Again, spice it up. You can put some colourful heels on, put some sparkly heels on, sparkly bag, put a little belt around your middle. Who knows? Talking about heels, I've actually got one pair in this haul. Really nice, simple, cute gold little pair. I really like these. I like the straight toe detail. I like how simple they are. They've got a little tie around your ankle. That's it. And and they're not too high either. I cannot walk in high heels at all. I do prefer a chunky heel. I feel like I'm a little bit more stable in them. But I saw these and I thought these are cute, not too high, nice and simple. Put these little gold bag on, that jumpsuit, put a belt on with some gold details, some gold jewellery. Ta-da, perfect. Again, I have no idea how to hold this, but this is a one, this is a one shoulder, midi, floaty little satin dress. It's got little tie details. So it's kind of like a skirt that you tie in around. So like one leg's out, but it's tied around your front. I like this material as well, because with it being kind of loose and floaty, I don't feel like it's going to cling to my belly. So I feel like every girl, unless you're really, really lucky, has got that little pouch at the bottom of the belly. So anything that clings to this, not really a fan. Probably going to be sitting there holding my bag over it all night. But if it's something like this where I can just tie it over, it's a little bit loose. Black's more flattering as well. And I just like the little strap detail again. Super cute. So we'll try this on. Again, a little bit more fancy. But I just thought I'd give you all some options and some inspo. I know I was talking about earlier these black leather trousers that I literally never take off. I can try and put a picture on the screen. From Pretty Little Thing as well, black straight leg trousers and got a little slit on the thigh. Love those so much. But I thought I'm going to get some brown leather trousers just to kind of warm it up a little bit. Instead of just wearing an all black outfit, put say, that black corset top on. And then some little brown trousers. I mean, I don't know if I like these. They're giving more like purple than brown. Um, I wanted kind of like a nice sort of chocolatey brown, but these look a bit purple red. I don't know. So we'll try them on. But I do like the leather trays from Pretty Little Thing. I feel like they're very flattering, not stretchy, so I'd always get the size up if you're in between sizes. But I just thought that these would keep me nice and warm. I've got a nice on the inside as well. It's kind of like a little fleecy layer. It's not too thick, but there is like a little fleecy layer, so it's not going to stick to you, I don't think. Oh, so I'll try these on. Not too keen on the colour, but you know, we'll give it a go. I know you can't see my face, so I'm going to have to try and stand up. But here's the little shorts. They fit really well, to be honest. Like, they're not too big at the back. I mean, they are a tiny little bit, but they're not, like, hanging off. They feel quite comfortable. I don't feel really restricted. I like this little detail. I feel like it's cute. And again, it just feels, like, more glam. Like, I feel quite dressy. Just realised this is inside out. Let's ignore that. Here is the little blazer. I know my hair... Num hair's absolutely everywhere right now. But see, I like this little detail. These are actually buttons as well, so you click it into place. Nice and secure. I like the material. Now, who's ready to see the back? For the back. Don't tell me I've got back rolls, please. But how pretty is that? I love that detail. Try and step back a bit. Obviously, you can see the big fat tag hanging out, but... Here is the little corset top. I look like Dora the Explorer with my hair like this. I'm just trying to do a little close-ups. This is very cute. Obviously, it's quite simple. I probably could have got a 10. I'm not going to lie. I did size up just thinking it'd be too tight. I have had courses from Pretty Little Thing before where I've got a 10. Literally can't do them up at the back. So, but this one's quite roomy, to be fair. So, probably just get my normal size if I ordered it again. But there's the back. She's very cute. Here's the little tag sticking out the side. I do like this. Like I said earlier, it's kind of like my safe option. This one has pleasantly surprised me. I mean, I know it's just like a plain jumpsuit, but I actually really like it. It fits me quite well. I feel quite confident. It's cute. So we've got, like I said earlier, the bandeau, then the one shoulder detail. I feel like you could probably put a little belt on, something sparkly. This bag's actually from Pretty Little Thing. Obviously, it's got the little gold detail. Probably put a cute gold bag on to match. Very flattering. Like I said, and it's not even too long. Don't know if you can really see, but it's not too long for me. Obviously, it's a little bit too long now, but if I put heels on, it's like a perfect length. I really like this. The material's really good as well. It's quite stretchy. It doesn't seem like it'd be see-through, and I've got big ring lights on me right now, so I feel like this would be the way to tell if it was see-through or not. Maybe editing this back, I'm going to be like, oh my God, I can't even put that in. But I think this is really pretty. Really nice, so kind of like a bandage material. Obviously not as like thick and corset pulling as like the PLT's premium bandage. But it just feels like it's cinching me in. Really like this one. Probably my favourite yet so far. Okay, so this one is not fitting half as well as the others. I know a cowl neck's supposed to be like this, but it literally is not fitting this side of my chest area in. But the idea was cute. It's obviously got the little glittery straps. 
The back's a little tie up detail. You'd probably tie it up a lot better if someone was here to help you. It is a cute idea. It's just not really fitting me. I think if someone else was here to tie the back up for me, it'd probably fit me a little bit better. This is giving black bag chic. She's not cute. She's not that flattering. Like I said earlier, it's nice and loose. Not really clinging to me, but I just look like a bin liner. Not the prettiest outfit I've got out of this haul. It's kind of cute, but I just, I don't know. It's not really like, it's not my favourite, so. This is as much as I can get on. I mean, <laughs> she's cute. She's giving Cinderella ran away and lost her shoe vibes. I do kind of love it. Some people are probably gonna hate it. I love it. I just wish I could actually get it on my body. Got it around my waist, that's as high as I can get it. But yeah, she's cute. I might order it in a bigger size because I really, 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 really want to be able to try this on properly. We've got the brown leather trousers that look bright red. Like, this is the colour I would dye my hair if I wanted like a subtle red look. I mean, they fit nicely. They're not too long. I, they don't smell a fish. That's one thing I will give them props, but I'm just not a fan of the colour. Sorry. So that is the end of the video. I really hope you found these helpful. I'll send a link everything down below like normal. Please make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in my next one.